Hi, it's Mitch from PickDogs.com. Here with your free pick in the Red Sox versus Rays Major League Baseball matchup on Wednesday, May 15, 2024. If you like all the free picks we do at Pick Dogs, you'll love our premium picks, our best bets. Use the discount code PICK. Take 15% off. We also have products meant for people who make big bets, people with big bankrolls, looking for that VIP one-on-one -on -one concierge style service. We offer these products. They're just not available under the premium picks tab at the website. You just got to text the number you see on the screen. So if you make big bets like I do, text the number. But let's get to it. Red Sox taking on the Rays. Tanner Houck on the bump for the Red Sox. It is Taj Bradley on the mound for the Rays. And while these teams' records look very, very close on paper, what doesn't look very close is their record over the last 10 games or so. As it is the Rays starting to surge forward into the standings, something we kind of see from them every single year. And the Red Sox starting to regress in the standings, something we expected from this team because of this pitching staff, which seems to be lacking like a true number one starter. I think overall the Red Sox pitching staff has pitched way above their pay grade, way above expectations. But over the course of a major league season, facing major league hitters, well, you are going to pay the price if you don't have the guns to get it done. And Tanner Houck on the bump for this one for the Red Sox. He's pitched pretty well overall above expectations like most of this Red Sox pitching staff, but it's one of these things where he's got a 2.24 ERA. He's allowed just 43 hits over 52 and a third, eight walks, one home run with 50 strikeouts, all really good numbers. And you know, while I don't really look too much at pitchers' one loss records, but this kind of does tell the story. He's three and four on the season, despite that 2.24 ERA. So basically, you know, it, he's not getting the best of it, you know, even against, uh, even with those kind of numbers. When you look at the Rays, they go with Taj Bradley in this one, making just his second start of the season. Bradley, of course, an integral part of the rotation. But, uh, you know, last year he had the 5.59 ERA, but we did see glimpses from him in his rookie season. But this year, uh, you know, he had one start this season. He gave up just one run against the Yankees, allowing, uh, allowing four hits in that game over six innings. But the Rays didn't score a run in that game. So the one run that Bradley allowed, well, he got charged with the loss in that game as well. So once again, looking at starting pitchers, win-loss records, it's going to get you absolutely nowhere when handicapping baseball. When you look at, uh, you know, the Rays just absolutely dominating the Red Sox, 38 and 16 in the last 50, 36 and 16 in the last 52 meetings of these two teams. And the Red Sox, like I said, they are in a bit of a tailspin right now. When you look at the way that they've been hitting over the last 10 games, the Red Sox hitting just 188 versus right-handed pitching, down from their season average of 240 versus righties. Meanwhile, the Rays at 238 versus righties, couple of points of better than their season average. You know, the Red Sox bullpen continues to overachieve 2.65 ERA over their last uh, 10 games, 3.19 for the season. But the Rays, how have they continued to how have they continue to surge forward? The bullpen's gone from a 4.71 ERA all the way down to 2.08 over their last 10 games. Oh man, we all have seen this a million times when the Rays get rolling. Just clear out of the way, and we're always going to get value on the small market. I'm going to take the raise, and that's going to be my free pick. Of course, while you're doing your picks, putting your bets in, be sure to use our free betting tools at sportschatplace.com. 100% free, and they'll help put you on the most favorable bets on the board today.